All right, so let's talk about Girlfriend Experience. Yeah. This is a great uh, series for you. Uh, Soderbergh, Steven Soderbergh, mm -hmm. taking from his movie, making this for stars. What drew you to this part? I really liked their viewpoint on the, the character and the story, that it wasn't a sort of tragic, abused girl who ends up in sex work and, and it was very much her decision. Well, the character is so compelling and watchable. You know, just this idea that you're at the University of Chicago Law School mm -hmm. and uh, basically a high-end call girl really is what right, it is, yeah. prostitute. Did you do any, did you talk to anybody? Amy and Lodge had, um, had been talking to some GFEs and um, gave me, I, there was one that I got to talk to a, a bit I asked a lot about the the emotional side of things because I had I had that was the thing I had a hard time with was that you know having sex with walking into a room and having sex with someone you don't know mm -hmm. like that's something that I, I personally could never do. Mm -hmm. <laughs> um, it was definitely a little bit scary going into something that you know we had I had sex scenes every day and it was a lot and and it's not the sex part that you have to constantly be connecting with the other different actors every day in that mm -hmm. way, you know? That was scary to me. It's been a banner year for you. Yeah, it's been pretty cool. I loved Mad Max. Let's just say that right now. Everyone knows that. Who knows me? I love this movie. And you were great in it, and I was really happy uh, about that. And it was such a standout part yeah. uh, for you. Did you guys have any idea when you were in the middle of nowhere mm -hmm. uh, for months at a time, mm -hmm. that this movie was going to kind of have the impact that it's had. Um, I, for, I, I didn't. Um, I don't. I don't think any of us did really. I mean, we knew it was going to be really special, and it, you know, I think we all knew it was different than your average um, blockbuster action film for sure. Uh, you got married. Mm -hmm. You celebrating a year? Is it almost? Yeah. Wow. Where did do you met? I heard that you met your husband on Mad Max, is that true? Yeah, I met him on Mad Max um, in 2012. And then I did reshoots a year later and the crew was smaller and um, that's when I kind of, you know, started hanging out with him and then we started dating and then I stayed in Australia for like two months or something, I don't know, or a month, I don't know. So, <laughs> so has it been a year? It's been a year in February. Nice, oh, so we're yeah. coming up on two. February 4th. Ah, yeah. almost a year anniversary. Mm -hmm. Wow, newlyweds. I like that. Yeah. How's it been? It's been good. That's great. Yeah. Uh, and here you are at Sundance with yeah. you. Yeah. Thanks. Wild.